just having a look at a, uh, a swing, single shot uh, 22 target rifle I've got here. Now this, this rifle has not been performing as well as what it should do. Um, it's got a heavy barrel, single shot, um, you know, it should be shooting pretty tight groups, but, but it hasn't been performing so well. So I was having a look at it with my bore scope and uh, it gives you an idea of really what is wrong with it. So let's take out the bolt here and we'll have a look. Now I'm starting, I'm starting out looking with a 90 degree mirror on the camera. Let's just go up the barrel a little bit. Okay, so if we look at the lands there, you can see they're beautiful. I mean, it's got nice, sharp rifling. It's got little lines across the lands. This is typical of a button rifle barrel. And um, there's nothing wrong with this barrel at all. It's, it's very good. You can see it's, uh, it's got a nice internal finish. Um, it should be a tack driver. So why isn't it? So let's just go back a bit now to look at the edge of the chamber. So this is where the chamber is is uh, leading into the um, the rifling. Now here you can see as we rotate we've got all of a sudden look at this look at this so this these lands are coming down really unevenly. Okay we'll rotate we'll come back up look at that that one there look at this here now so you can see that there's something um, not right. And what it is, is is that the chamber has been cut uh, off axis to the, um, to the bore of the barrel. And um, let's just have a look at this without the right angle mirror. We'll take the mirror off the end of the scope here. Slip it down. And look at that now. Let's get look at that there. How now on one side uh, we can see. Just get a good view. We can see that there's a, a clear uh, edge to the to the where the chamber goes to the barrel. On the other side there isn't. So you can see that the chamber has been cut off off center to one side. And this is going to mean that the projectile when it goes into the rifling is pushed against one side more differently to the other side, which could it out of balance um, and it's going to result in the rifle performing nowhere near what it should right because it's a good barrel it's a good good rifle but um, unless the chamber unless all these little details are perfect um, you won't get the optimum performance from it and without this bore scope i would never have found this problem uh, and uh, i'm not uh, pointing the finger at any manufacturer for this this is, I've seen this sort of effect on in many different brands of, uh, of firearms, both rifles and pistols. Um, and uh, the way that the chambering is done is, is critical for, for accuracy. But, you know, the big, big factories, they don't always get it perfect.